produce those results consistently. Yeah, so our final match, uh, match of the night, guys. Let's this, get it. Let's get it, man. Let's get hype. I mean, this is a hell of a one to close out on, too. Let me tell you. CLG Void, Phoenix One, Zach. These guys. I always have fun watching you guys play. Same here, man. Same here. I was, just like I was mentioning before, the fact that he's able to just play so well mm -hmm. against Bayonetta is going to be making a really exciting match to watch. As we did see him versus Mistake go down to a game five. True. Right now, he's been taking a lot of the pace. Ooh. He is the pace, man. Oh, yeah, he is the pace. And the cap. Yo. Okay. All right. Oh, All right. You're sick. You're you sick. You need a stop. You're sick. Wait, but a down smash? Down air. No, we're going down. And footstool. Footstool. Yeah, yeah. The great job right there by yeah. Captain Zach. Well done. Trying to get around. He had to go for the, the witch type. Of course, in that situation, it, it, you know, it works out really well for him, right? You have to, you have to turn around the tables. It's, it's tough. But oh no, you don't want to get hit by that. You don't want to get hit by that. And you don't want to get hit by that. There it is, been in a splitting in midair. How flexible can she be? There it is, Captain Zach with the first game. Yeah, and then, you know, that's very unfortunate for Void. I feel like it was, you know, he's playing extremely well. Yep. Uh, but there was two critical errors he made up. Obviously, uh, being at the edge of that percent, you know, that's going to be early kill there, or going with the dare. That's always going to be one of those. New options that you see a lot of bayonets will go for, you know, certain kind of scenarios. So you always have to be cognizant of that. But man, it just happened that platform layout was just so perfect for Captain Zach to get that up tilt. And even up tilts at the ground levels are a dangerous thing, let alone getting up tilt to already, you know, a third way up. And here it is, Captain Zach trying to see if he can catch Void right there, but Void making sure to dip low, delay his recovery, and not fall prey. Mm -hmm. A lot of the off stage options from Captain Zach. One of the things, though, Void is going to have to be careful for is the fact that Zach will go for that witch time, man. Yeah. Like, uh, we've seen a lot yeah. of witch time from him uh, when he was playing. Who was he playing? He was actually playing against Nairo, right? Right. Yeah. So, we'll see. He's got to know for the, to recognize those times where you're going to have to pull back. Yeah, absolutely. Because he, he, he was actually doing a really good job in the beginning. But here it is. Okay, these aggressive... <laughs> This, I'm loving these aggressive uh, dive kicks, actually, because right. you would have thought that after the nerf that we wouldn't see that anymore. Get the DI on the up air. Yep, and actually it's accepting that down there right there with the back air by Captain Zack. But here it is, right. Void making sure to get those needles. Put a good grenade out as well. But invincibility, even though it ran out, did not. The needles didn't quite work out. Yeah, just a little too early there with the needles. But I love the idea behind it. No bouncing fish. High recovery right here. And that's an opening. Void just waited because sometimes the bayonetta may hold a button down your set, right? Alright. Get those guns out. Back on the stage. Too much percentage right here to get a confirmed. A nice shield by Zach too. Oh, that's not a good part. Yep, easy needles. Find some pressure here, but Void still here. I love the chase. Yeah. Grabbing the edge again, forcing Void to have to get back on. You saw Zach with the down air. Yeah, yeah, man. I mean, the, the lack of damage. Wow, falling up there. I love the reversal. Very good move right there. And Void getting right back into the break. Woo! The eye right there by Zach. Saw that. And he put out the neutral air too, just to make sure that Void wasn't able to get the hit on. Right. High recovery. Can you go double jump? I love the wish Twitch trying to get out. Just make sure you know that you... Oh, my Whoa. God. Okay. All right. <laughs> Rockefeller. A lot of times we do see Bayonetta mates, you know, just go for that and jump. So you might as well throw your diamonds to the sky. Yeah, if you see that, I feel a lot. Yeah, man. I mean, he felt the vibe for sure. <laughs> Waiting. Catch. He's going to pull him down. I okay. like it. Good amount of damage. That's not going to kill. 99% though. Mm -hmm. What's your one? <laughs> 90. Uh, actually, wait. 54% right now. Yeah. Boy, going for a lot of these trades here. It's almost as if he's in a. a in like, I got nothing to lose mode right now. You oh, yeah, know, no, absolutely. Got the you got to play up. Oh, there it is. Okay, and he was still close enough to get that up smash confirmed off of the jab. Great job right there by Void and Captain Zach. 2-0 over Void. Wow. So I, I do believe that in a majority of these guys' interactions, though, usually uh, Void is the one that tends to come out on top. Yeah. 
Captain Zach playing uh, obscenely well right now. He's going to be up 2-0. Can Void hunger down on this? Can he figure out what he needs to adjust in order to move forward? We shall see, man. It's like the players, you know, coming into this tournament, of course, you know, a lot of the, the high seeds were like three mistakes Salem, right? Um, actually, Captain Zach seeded 12 just underneath Void was 11, you know. Interesting scenarios right here. Cap Zachary showing that he's still got it. Like, I feel like a lot of people have been sleeping on him and haven't been yeah. shouting him out as much. Oh, absolutely. I mean, right now, everyone's talking about mistake, mistake tweak, tweak, Salem. That, yeah. Those are the people they're talking about. Everyone looks at, oh, well, Captain Zach, I, I don't know. No, I mean, this guy is still, still doing well. You know, he, he wasn't as high as he was initially, but he's still moving forward. He's doing the big things. Oh, boy, just try to see if he can get that back air. You know, you always see him get that back, cross yeah. the back air, bounce it. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, not really going for it that time, though. Pull down. Got a little bit of extra Pull damage. down again. Oh, my gosh. If you had gotten that, that was sick. Wow. wow. Was anyway. Catching the landing void. Mind you guys, this guy plays with tilt stick, so yep. it's crazy. There are multiple ways, of course, to execute smash attacks. You could even do, like, A plus B, dude. You know, True. Yeah. Nice. Well, needles. Yeah. Damage racking. And I like the crawls too. Repositioning himself, right? Yeah. Mobile target. There's again. Okay, I like fourth throw. Yeah, that was actually really smart too. High. He just recognized the shield and then went for that grab. Oh, oh you're tough dead. spot. You're dead. Yeah. Void. Yeah. A side of life right here and. Ladies and gentlemen, of yeah. course, and the of winner course. of this game is going to have to go up against me. Yeah. That's, that's, <laughs> that's going to be crazy. Regardless of who advances on, that's going to be an insane matchup. But right now, I love the play from Void. I love the adaptation there. You see him kind of a bit more laid back, uh, better on the CI. I love the traps he's getting there, man. Going through up air fastballs, always my favorite thing to see from him. Oh, he's going for the ledge. The boy, they were, like right now he's covering those things really well. Man, just running it back, man. Sushi for days, jeez. Okay, here comes Zach. Not gonna finish off that string. No, that's not going to kill. Okay, good cross there from Void. Make sure you can avoid a, a lot of the standard options that you're really going to see from Bayonetta there. Uh, she's a character kind of similar to Zero Suit where a lot of her offense is really going to be dictated by her going for a short or utilizing her aerials outside of a uh, down tilt and really heel slide. That was Perfect right there, the right distance for Boyd to actually be able to get the punish. But here it wow. is, man. What a play. Yes. Okay, try to see if we can potentially get that vanish right there, but of course, not quite working out. I just saw the aggressive option of yep. landing. Yeah, good guess right there from Gatchin Zach. Oh, but Boyd in the wrong, wrong direction right there. Patient play, realizing that this is his final stop. Yep, again. The reversal. Wow, wow! I love that. I love that. This guy really trying to make it into top eight. As yep. he knows, tomorrow he's going to have to face off against Tweak, and that's Tweak qualifying after facing off against Bros and X. All right. No pressure on there. Okay, going to start something off. Bouncing Fish, 24%. Yeah, we haven't really seen Captain Zach abuse the bullets on this stage. Yeah, just a little bit, it seems. You know, st styles, right? Yeah. Styles are definitely different right here between these guys. Of course. No one being at a place the same. Okay. Busting it up probably when he believes he needs it. But here it is. He's waiting for that air dodge boy. Because he has a lot more work cut out for him. 63%. Cap Zach has to watch out. Oh, okay. There That's it is. A movement. Nice. Right there, Cap Zach looking like. Oh, oh my, my kill! Boy wow. really wants to get yeah. this top eight, wow. man. 
Wow. Yo, get out of his head, boy. <laughs> oh, Definitely, <okay>. man. <laughs> Definitely <laughs> this man. <laughs> <laughs> Professor X, man. Yeah. <laughs> Charles. Professor V. Charles. <laughs> Professor V. Oh, okay. Dark Voice. Oh, 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 okay. Oh, this is Dark Voice. Okay. I didn't leave Hawaii for this. This is it, man. Again, ladies and gentlemen, the last set of the day, last game of the day, the final qualifier here. Yes. For the top eight at the Battle for Vegas. All right, and we're going to end it out on Lilac Cruise. Lilac Cruise, man. Oh. Manages to get out of the final hit of the fair right there. Boy, the empty jump shield. Okay. Yes. Okay. Definitely smart, dude, because a lot of times people just witch twist. Oh, what a catch. Uh oh, but that that's a scary part for Boy. Did have the jump, yep. so he's fortunate. Good save. Just like we saw before when he was playing mistake, though, if you try to go for a bouncing fish and you're still in midair, that you will automatically get the grenade pull, and that's yep. a bad spot, especially if you're lacking a jump. Okay, good interception right there, Captain Zach, but he's not able to convert. Good reposition right there by Boyd. Gets hit by... Hey, good stuff right there, Captain Zach. Wow! Oh, the catch, and that's <laughs> gonna be it! The right percent! Dark Boyd, man! And, you know, seeing the tag of Wayne, I wonder if this is John Wayne Airport he's shot out. Yeah, right. <laughs> John Wayne. It's like, this, this is my airport. Yep. <laughs> Captain Zach coming back, 12% right there. Now let's see what Zach can do here. I mean, okay. Zach has been playing phenomenal in the last strength, but I feel like he's been getting a little bit too predictable for Boyd in this neutral. Very that smart. Said, you saw that, right? Yeah, absolutely. The adjustment. Boyd had shield up. Went for the immediate up throw, up smash. Worked out. The, the witch times have been helping out Zach a lot. And with the slow percent, uh oh, there it is, Boyd. Manages to get out of this situation, but the bouncing oh, fist. Man. So much air. damage. Oh yeah. Yeah, what a string right there for Captain Zach. Put himself in the lead, and now he could just hang back and use these bullets right now to yep. rack up some safe damage on Boy. And I like this. I like this shift. Extend the lead. You know, you have to remind him that this is a viable option. This is something that he needs to be focusing on. Yep. And this time, Captain Zach, very confident here, but Boy with the DI gets underneath. Tries to see if he oh, can make something gosh, happen. Okay. Shield getting low. 52% here. Oh, oh no. Is that it? And yes, yes. And there it is. He gets the single hit witch twist and was able to convert even further, allowing him to get into a situation where now he is in the top eight.